So today I got some things in the mail and I figured I'd show you guys what I got. I ordered from Hot Topics a few things. And I got this Buffy shirt. It is super cute. It's just a tank top. It has a big Buffy bee right in the back along with the two stakes on the side. You see that? It's so cute. So Buffy's having its 20th anniversary and I was definitely really, really happy that Hot Topic was doing a little mini collection on her items and that is one of the items that they had. They also have a red leather jacket. It's kind of long, really, really cute, but I unfortunately, I just I can't bring myself to buy it yet. Maybe if it goes on sale, me, oh God, I really don't need another jacket. I bought so many coats last season and a lot of them were from Hot Topic. The next item that I got was this sports bra. It's Harley Quinn. Um, I will never be able to use it as a sports bra, but it's more of a tank top underneath the shirt that I have that has Harley Quinn on it. So I figured because I cut off the sleeves and it was a men's shirt, so the sleeve cutout is very low on the arm, you know, I this would work out perfectly it's really cute and I was actually surprised I already tried it on and it does fit which is surprising because it looks I don't know it looks a little small but it works out fine at least for the purpose that I need it the next item is of course the matching pants and these are super cute they do they are capris and they do say mad love on them these I know, I didn't try these on, but just looking at them, they'll definitely fit. Goes with the sports bra, goes with the shirt that I want to wear. You know, I like to dress in theme, so this would be perfect for that. It's just what I like to do. And because I apparently shop in theme too, I bought another Suicide Squad shirt with Harley Quinn on it. And the Joker, it was $5, so I feel like... It's a good enough reason for me to buy another t-shirt. I did buy this in a 3X hoping it was oversized, but honestly, I'm, I'm looking at it and it's long, but it's not really wide. It's like kind of fit perfectly fine. It's going to be a normal t-shirt, not an oversized t-shirt like I wanted, but sometimes their stuff comes in a little small. I'm just not sure if this is men's or if this is ladies, probably ladies. That's why I feel like it's a little short. But it went from $26.90 to $5. So that's a good deal. And keeping with the theme, the next item I got was the red Harley Quinn dress. This was on sale for $25. So I feel like it's a deal. And it has this lovely print that it says put in. It has the Harley Quinn um, diamonds on it. It's hard to tell because it's still the same material. It's just like almost like an embossing in the material. Very cute. And the top is like faux leather with studs. And it has a zipper in the back, which I hate zippers in the back because my hair always gets caught in them. But that's fine because it's Harley Quinn dress you gotta wear your hair Harley Quinn style so yeah I'll be putting that in ponytails just like Harley and I'll probably be wearing this one tomorrow because I really like it I'll just have to steam it it's a little wrinkled it was in a package in a box um, I have about four pieces I want to say of the Suicide Squad collection that Hot Topic launched and this was one of the ones that I had my eye on but because like I had already spent a lot of money on the bomber jacket and I also bought the sequined black and gold dress along with a sweater and I think I think that's all I have I'm not sure um I just couldn't bring myself to spend the $80 that this dress originally cost but with it being on sale, I think it's clearance. I'm going to assume it's clearance because it's been like a full summer. The Suicide Squad movie came out like a year ago. So $25, great deal. I did try it on and it's a little bit, it's a little big. 
I'm always in between an 18 and a 20 because I'm about a 2x and it's it's hard to tell so I did read the reviews and I always go up for the I always go up one instead of down one unless I hear that it's like a knit or that it has a lot of stretch in it this one actually I feel like for my size it I could have gone down down a number and it would have fit perfectly right now it's okay it's a little loose though my last item that I got is was also a super deal. I thought I was probably not going to buy it because I didn't have a special occasion to wear it to, but it is the Regina dress from Once Upon a Time. This dress has the most amazing collar, and I've already tried this on, and it does stand up. And it has this beautiful lace, beautiful purple, and this pattern is like a velvety smooth pattern like it's velvety I don't know what to call it velvety maybe it's very nice it has this cute peplum the weirdest thing though is the zipper it opens only that much and it's like in the middle of the back I mean it blends in really well it's just really funny how it's just like this random opening but other than that, this dress is beautiful. It does have tulle on the bottom, on the inside, to, you know, not make it so flat. It doesn't give you a whole lot of poof, which, you know, is okay for some people who don't want the poof. I personally love extreme poof. So if I could put in, like, some kind of petticoat under there, I am probably going to do that. And it's definitely a fall dress, so this one's not going to come out till fall. And since we're in the middle of summer, it's going to be a while until I have a chance to wear it. It's just, the colors are just very fall, and it's very, like, it looks very evil queen. It makes me feel like an evil queen. It's amazing. It was originally $99.90, and I did manage to get this for $33, which is an amazing price. And that's $33 plus tax, so it's not, it's still really really good price it's still less than half of the price that it was originally hopefully you'll enjoy watching me talk about the things that I buy because I love to talk about shopping and clothes and things that I want to purchase too like that Buffy jacket that I don't don't need but I really really want but oh well talk to you guys later bye